Hi and welcome to Add More Zest with Diamonds. My name's Rebecca and I've got quite an ex... well, I think it's exciting anyway. A uh, new product for you from Art Dot. Um, so I will pop a link to this down below. But let me just get hold of some scissors to get in this. Um, but yeah, this is diamond painting, but diamond painting freestyle. Uh, it's one of their new products, of which they keep coming out with a few, but this is a Diamond Art Freestyle sticker. So it says, what is the colour of the rainbow? It's up to you. It has instructions on the back. Uh, it does say to remove the protective film. It does say to use the letter A for a dark colour, the letter B for any colour in succession, um, C for white and then the diamond for any colour. Um, you complete it, you remove the backing film and then it becomes a sticker. So you get 38 stickers in here. Uh, pen, wax, tray and some diamonds. So let's have a look at what's actually in the box. I can imagine some kids having an absolute ball with this. Oh, this accessory kit is cute. Okay, let's have a look at the accessory kit. Um, I say it's cute just because it's got a different style tray in it. Uh, so this, it looks like they potentially will clip together with other ones. There is a little, li a little extra part on this side and a little gap on this side. Uh, does have a little pouring spout. Don't know how that will work out, but you do get a pen with a single placer and a three placer. You do get some blue wax and you do get a blue squishy. That's a nice colour, blue squishy. I don't know if I've seen a blue squishy in that colour before. Uh, so you do get a toolkit for doing these. You get a lot of diamonds, a lot of bright colour diamonds as well. As well as, of course, some freestyle ones. Uh, but we do have a few black because it does say a dark colour on the ones that are a letter A, so I'm guessing that's why they've given you so much black. So there is also some greys, there's some whites, there's some pinks. They do all have DMC numbers on them. So if you want the DMC numbers to maybe grab some more from your own stash or anything, you can but there's quite a nice selection of pinks, purples, blues, some turquoise going into green, and then we've got some greens, oh, lime green, uh, going into yellows, going into oranges, peaches, pinks, and reds. So there is plenty of colours to choose from for these. So let me see if I can get those to sort of snake in there the same way they were before-ish. So they will still fit back in there but you have a wide array of colours. But what I really want to see is these stickers. The different types and how they work. So yeah, they say on the back, so it is freestyle, they do say any dark colour, so you could potentially use some grey, but they do put in enough black, and that's so that you can see what the image would be. So you could potentially put a dark pink on this one. However, it is round diamonds, um, so if you're using round diamonds, do note that you may see that outer colour. I still think that could potentially work with a dark pink and then a small pink on the in, uh, lighter pink on the inside. Uh, maybe a dark green and then a light green for the leaf. But we have a rose, 
Maybe that's a leaf. Maybe it's a teardrop. Could be anything you want because who says that you've got to put one colour in the middle? It can be any colour in the middle. So you could pop a smiley face on that one, make it a tear and put a sad face. Then we do have one with the letter C that says basically to use white in that one or they suggest that you use white in the letter C and then you dark colour to give it its definition. We've got a star, we've got a diamond, we've got a heart. I'm looking out for the other letter symbol as well. We've got a peace sign and it does have pop out bits in the middle of this. Uh, we've got another flower, there we go. So there it's got ones going in succession for the letter B. So that will give it some shading. Smiley face, peace, peace man. Uh, we've got, oh, that's a gorgeous pattern one. Nice knot. We've got a cupcake. Sometimes I have to look in the camera to actually see what these are. Oh, we've got a donut. And again, this one uses the B to give the shading to help you make it still look like a donut. Uh, a paw print put it the right way up, uh, a flower and again that's got the letter B on for shading which is to make it look like a flower. We've got a light bulb, we've got a moon, uh, an ice cream, that's a cute little ice cream, we've got a rainbow, a flower pot, a planet, a musical note. I'm going to have to start layering these up. Not sure what... Oh, maybe it's a lolly. Ice lolly. Uh, we've got a lightning bolt. A crown. That too has got some of the letter C in there as well. Uh, we've got a butterfly. We've got... Is that flamingo? Oh, flamingo. A oh, little chick. It's a little chick. When I look in the camera, it's clearer. Uh, then we've got a bow, another sort of lotus, a flower, a angel wings maybe, could be a butterfly as well, depends on your colours. Uh, another sort of lollipop. In fact, there's a couple of those. A couple of sweeties, another flower, a treble clef. A unicorn and another, is that like a feather? Could be a feather, could be a sword. You decide. Uh, there is a couple of examples in relation to the heart in different ways that they have been done. Um, so you do have some examples, though the heart itself actually doesn't, apart from saying to do a darker colour around the outside, you can see some of these they have done a really dark, some of them actually look more like a dark brown than they look like a black. Uh, there's a few more examples on their website, but I really love the concept of this. I think it's creativity mixed in with diamond painting. So you've got that little bit of a chance to play. Um, I do kind of hope that in the future they may do the stickers on their own. I think that would be um, good for those of us that already have maybe diamonds to use up or those that want to create more from the set. So like an add-on to have some more. But when you peel back the top coat, it is sticky where it needs to be and then if I try and peel off the back I just want to establish whether these are clear stickers I think they are but I do just want to confirm by peeling off the back but of course it keeps want to peel off the front <laughs> there we go so yes they are clear stickers which I prefer um, so even though it does have what looks like white around it once you peel it back 
so you will st still see the darker colour on the letter A but on all the other sections you won't you will see the background of whatever you stick it to uh, but yeah I think you could create some fun stickers for books maybe even create a masterpiece for a bedroom wall a chore chart maybe maybe stick some onto cards maybe you could stick them onto card and pop some magnet on the back or stick it even straight on to magnets the possibilities are endless uh, and I think these are going to be really really fun to do but you do get loads of diamonds in them I think this just tells you diamond set but I'm pretty sure it was about 40 colours when I looked on the website because I did want to check whether they did the sticker pack on its own or not um, but yeah I think there's about there's over 40 colours I'm pretty sure it's 44 but that might just be going um I could just be making that number up so I will pop the link down below to it uh, but yeah there's some really really fun different designs in there for you to give your create let your creative juices flow um with colors that suit you that's one of my favorites I love this knot as well I can imagine doing some of this in different shading um, and actually creating different shadings of a similar colour around that knot or maybe even having it go round as some form of rainbow <clears throat> would look good. I think there's endless possibilities of what you could do with these. I mean, even just looking at the hearts, they're all completely different um, in how they've been done. Whether you're following the pattern coming out, whether you've got lines going up at an angle, whether you've just got different parts of shading to just give different layers to the hearts. And that's just one of the stickers. So do let me know if any of you have got these or plan on getting them. And I would love to see the different things that you create with them. Um, and, you know, ideas you can share of how to make these your own and make them pop. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much to Art Dot for sending me these to share with you all. And thank you to all of you for watching. I'll speak to you all again soon.